There are many different ways of going from one row to the next when you are crocheting granny squares and I'm showing here the way that I find the easiest and quickest. Here I am at the end of the first row and I'm finishing off with a slip stitch to the start of the row. And then to continue I will chain four chain four this works both as the first double crochet of the next row as well as an extra stitch that we need for the corner so here is my chain and then I will make a double crochet into the corner going sort of over this chain so just directly into here into the gap in the corner and making a double crochet there and another one In this square I'm using groups of three double crochets. I know that you could also use four. And then this is the start, so then you just continue the row like normal. Uh, not going into that at the moment actually. Just so in the corner. And so on. And here now I am at the end of the second row. And again I'm finishing that row off with a slip stitch and then just the same as before four chain stitches and a double crochet into the corner And so on and then you continue the granny square normally and uh, this way when you start the rows like this then also the spot where you start always stays in the same place instead of moving about here so this is how it goes